Well, there's nearly 7,000 breweries in the U.S. now. So coming into this, we looked at what are different ways that we can set ourselves apart from other breweries that are out there. But we said, why don't we do something that's a little bit different, a little bit harder even, and just stick with kind of the, the German brewing tradition of minimal ingredients uh, needed to make beer. One big exception to that is the corn. We said, well, let's just change this one small aspect of that German tradition and make it grain, water, hops, and yeast, and that's all we use in our beers here. And that probably puts us in kind of the 5% minority of those 7,000 breweries in the U.S. Uh, that, that follow that spirit of traditional German brewing practice. We really hope that people come in and love our beer, right? First and foremost, we're a brewery. My brother and I are both trained brewmasters. We can just really focus on quality, freshness, uh, making exactly the product that we want to, that we're proud of to put our name on. We want the tap room to be a place where um, it's very warm and inviting. We don't have a TV in the joint, right? Disconnect, unplug from your device, and talk with people. The big communal tables um, encourage people to sit together, have conversations. A lot of times you're forced to sit with people you don't know, and that's so healthy and vital for our society, for people to have some beers together with strangers and at, at the end of the day walk, walk away having uh, formed a new friendship rather than just being plugged into a device watching something on the, on the wall. We've grown wheat now two years in a row right here next to the beer garden. So as you sit outside on a summer day, looking around uh, the, the fields, you know, it used to be it was corn or soybeans, right? But now you got something else to look at. Uh, you've got the wheat that we can point out and say, hey, um, you know, that's future Hefeweizen, our wheat beer, out there growing in the field right next to where you're enjoying it. We're also growing about 10 acres of barley down on the family farm this year. So we've been doing this incrementally, and as long as we can maintain the quality of the beer from the ingredients that we're able to grow here, then say, okay, now this is, the, this is what we learned this year. Let's go forward and do better next year, grow a little bit more, and increase that percentage that we're, we're growing ourselves. Our story, the family farm, German train, that might sell the first beer, but the beer has to sell the second beer. We're all working towards that same goal of you know, making the best product that we can and, uh, and something that we can be proud of.